All right, guys, I am getting ready to hit the road to continue the 2023 Spirit Halloween Halloween tour. But today I am in Canton, Ohio on Atlantic Boulevard at this Spirit Halloween, which I filmed before in past years. And this used to be an Aaron's rental store, I believe. Kind of like a rent-a-center. If you want to buy a TV and you don't have enough money, you go in here and you rent it to own it. I wish I could own that sign up there. All right, let's go on in here, guys, and see what it looks like. Canton, Ohio, right off Route 62, Atlantic Boulevard. Not too shababbly. Right up front, we have the widow. Hello, the widow. <laughs> Oh, and here we go with an eternal rest right around the corner here. 50% off because the spinning head is not working. I wonder if that means that it's not spinning at all or if it's spinning without stopping like the other ones we've seen. We have a sitting scarecrow here. I don't believe that he's the scary sitting scarecrow. Although you could argue that he is kind of scary. All right, let's go ahead and leave him some stickers in his bowl. Let's say hello to the straw man here. Hello, straw man. Did you know that this land is cursed? Yeah, guys, this is a much smaller store than a lot of them I've been in this season. But here's a ginormous pile of animatronics over here. We'll go see them in a second, but I had to stop over here first because look at this. They actually have the creeping cats and the secret keeping cats and all the zombie babies together in one area. And look, they even have a hello wrap. And if you didn't already know, you can actually get a t-shirt from my store right now that says hello rat. Hello intestine. All right, let's just come on over here and take a look at the animatronics they have for sale on the floor. We have a black heart right here. We have a slim over here on this side. We have a stilt, aka Papa Pins. We have a Desmodus right here. Another black heart. Whoa, we have a Gordo. A lot of people are telling me that the Gordos are sold out. If I was smart, I would buy that Gordo and have two of them. Anyway, we have another stilts here. Let's see. On the other side, we have two howling spirits. Look at this. We have two darling dollies. We have a The Widow, a little Skelly Bones, and a Another stilts. Oh, and the Mars Attacks guy right here. We can't forget about him with his ginormous head. All right, hold on. Let's look at how much he is one more time here. Three ninety nine. I have a twenty percent off coupon, which would take off about eighty bucks. I know I am gonna regret it if I don't buy him and I can't get him later on. All right, let's just take a quick walk around the rest of the store here for a minute and see if anything else pops out at us that we have not seen in other stores. I'm always on the lookout for another Crouchy doll. I've only seen him in one store this season. I see some cauldrons over here. Let's leave a few stickers in each. Last year they had a whole stack of animatronics right over here in this area, but it must be that all they have left are the ones that we already looked at up there. I was in Costco today and they had pumpkins and they had one where the stem was smashed down and it reminded me of Squidward's face. All right, let's come back and take a look at these masks back here. See if there's any masks that we haven't seen in other stores. They have this guy, the green alien. You gotta love his eyes and his teeth. His teeth kind of remind me of the alien movie, actually. I don't know what this guy reminds me of. <laughs> I'm not big on devil stuff, but I can't ignore how much these horns look like the Hexpawn's horns. And this guy is always awesome. The creature from the Black Lagoon. But if it's from the Black Lagoon. Why is he green? Could you answer that, Mr. Big Brain? Some of these masks are so thin, they just feel like they're gonna tear in a second. But then, like the creature mask, it is so thick, it feels like you couldn't even cut through that with scissors. Or a dagger! Have we ever looked at the flesh creature mask. It's like a giant mouth with enormous fangs. It's funny to me how many different Michael Myers masks they have. Okay, they have this one here, 
We have this one here. This one, which is Halloween 1. Halloween 2 over here. And then you have this one, which is simply the face and no hair at all. Wait a minute, have we seen this purple hair clown? I don't know if I've ever seen him before. He looks pretty cool. I do like this plain old skeleton mask here. Rather than just being something that's totally crazy, it's just a skeleton. And we have this vintage clown mask here, which is completely different than this one. And this one up here almost looks like Darling Dolly. I do like this skull on a rope here too. I don't know if I've actually seen these in other stores this season. They've probably been there, I just haven't been looking good enough. Somebody was asking me again to look at the Fall Guys costume, so let's take a look at them here. We have a Spooky Doodles inflatable. This one is actually pretty cool. We have the blue inflatable here where he's wearing a crown. We have the Skelly inflatable. That is possibly my favorite one of them all. And we have the pink inflatable. And of course we have the Spooky Doodles backpack. You know, another thing I also haven't seen this season at all that I was looking for last season too is the shrunken head. Chances are they won't have it, but let's take a look. If we can find the voodoo stuff here. Uh, is this voodoo? No. This is a smaller store, so I'd be very surprised if we do happen to find one. Where the heck is the voodoo stuff? This is a pretty cool South Park beanie. What the heck? Surprisingly, I'm not even finding any voodoo stuff at all. Hmm, very, very strange. All right, let's take a walk through the costumes here and see if there's any costumes that jump out at us. Here's a Link costume from Zelda. You gotta love the inflatable gizmo. Here's a couple more Fall Guys here. We have an orange one here called Orange Aid. We got the Blue Freeze here. And we have the chicken inflatable. I'm still trying to figure out what a Yeetus hammer is. They do have a pretty big selection of Fortnite costumes. I personally like punk. Oh my gosh, guys, look, they actually have ghillie suits. Let's leave some stickers for Jack. And look at this, this has gotta be the littlest Sam costume I ever done saw. Look, this is called the Trickster Clown and the Carnival Cutie. Wait, have we seen the Frankenstein throw? We probably have, but I forgot. That is so cool. I love the green in that one. They do have the ghost face plush. You gotta give them credit for that. And a couple of soul girls on swings. I said this in one of the other videos, but this is probably my favorite inflatable dinosaur costume ever. Reptar from Rugrats. All right, guys, there you go. Just a quick look at this Spirit Halloween offer route 62 in Canton. I did leave a whole bunch. Hold on, wait, get out of here. There's a bee trying to get me. <laughs> I did leave a whole bunch of stickers if you want to come down and get some. <laughs>